Welcome wonderful people and today we're going to be playing Mad Father as you can see here on the title. Um We're going to start the new game of course and um I have unlocked this one because I already played the game to know exactly not exactly what I was doing to an extent but to have an idea. That was my plan, but it was I ended up finishing it. It was so good. Anyways, now we're going to start with the normal mode. And we obviously are going to start from the prologue. This does not have voice acting. I'm going to read the text, but not do the voices because my voice will be extremely strained. I hope you can forgive me. Let's get to it. Father. Father, are you in there? Father. Aya, oh, yeah. how many times have I told you not to come down here? Sorry, Father, but I'm too scared to sleep on my own. Aya. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, you're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. She's always watching over you, Aya. Okay? Now please, go to bed. Yes, father. Good girl. Father, tomorrow's... Yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now, back to bed, please. I'll be resting too, shortly. Yes, father. Stop! No! Ah! Help me! Help! Oh, we just go. I know father's secret. My father is a scientist. He loves research and is always locked up in the lab in the basement. And I've always heard things from that lab animal and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing, so I pretended I wasn't looking, that I didn't know or hear anything. 
I've been in ignorance the whole time. Because I loved father. That's not the only secret I know. When mom and I weren't around, he and his helper. A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining, mat the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. Doctor. The mistress is aware of our relationship. Hmm. What does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. The girl will be loving soon. It's a troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Ensure that she never has come to harm. She shall always be my most precious. Now, I know the game starts a little bit slow, right? Don't worry, it's gonna start get it picking up real fast, believe me. So, we're in bed. Hmm, it's midnight. Today's the day mom went to heaven. Mom. Now that I'm thinking about mom, I can't get to sleep. Explore the room. <clears throat> Let's see. Your favorite doll. Hmm. A doll I got from father. It's so old and worn. I brought you a present, Aya. Yay, it's a doll. Thank you, father. Huh, what a pretty doll. It's almost like she's alive. That was a memory, and look at this. The snowball, the pet rabbit. The snowball is sleeping soundly, okay. The red eye stranger. Something fell out. What is this? Got a gem. Tips. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require you in special events to get. You can see your gem count in the menu. Find them all and something might happen. One out of twenty. Orus the traitor. A plain dresser. A portrait of mom. Mom. We're very look alike, sec except the hair. Everything else is pretty similar. What should I do, Mom? I do love father, but she scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. I hate her. But I know father likes her. If father and her got married, I guess she would be my new mom. I don't want her to be my mom. I don't need a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Mom, why did you have to go? The room feels cold all of a sudden. Huh, I'm kind of scared. I should get back to bed. Let's go back to bed. In we go. Good night. Or is it? You sing so well, Aya. Can I turn around now, father? Just a moment. Just put this here. Yes, it is finished. A flower crown. Does it look good on me? Yes, I think it suits you well. Yay! Thank you, father. I'm sorry I can't always play with you. No, oh, father. It's alright. I'm glad we could finally play today, father. Oh my, how unusual. You two were playing. Mom? 
Look, father made me a flower crown. Oh, that's wonderful. It looks great on you, Aya. So, you played with him all day? Yeah. We should do this again, father. Yes, we should. Next time, your mother should join in. Well, I look forward to it. <coughs> Mom! I'm sorry. Just another fit. <coughs> Don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come, get some medicine from Maria. It will help you get better. No, I can get that myself. Mom, are you hurt? Y you're okay, right? Sorry to worry you. I'm perfectly fine. Don't look so anxious, please. Aya, your smile keeps me going best of all. If I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom? Okay. Now, let's get back for dinner. I made sirloin sir steak tonight. Your favorite, Aya? <gasps> I love mom's steaks. Right, father? <laughs> of course. She makes the best steaks in the world. Such sweet memories, don't you all think? So, so sweet. Maybe too sweet. We were so happy back then. There was Maria too, but even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then mom passed away from illness, and all the happiness we had just banished or did it okay my wonderful people what that scream could that have been father did you hear a scream my people because I heard nothing something must have happened I'll go check on father yo wait give me a second because I heard absolutely nothing now that I think about it, I'm not hearing anything. Yeah, I mean... Oh god, I almost deafened myself. Okay. Jesus. Okay, I had it on the lowest volume. I'm sorry! <laughs> uh, okay. Snowball. Is he sleeping soundly? Okay. A plain dresser. Um, our favorite doll. Okay, let's go out, I suppose. I have a bad feeling. It cannot be worse than what's gonna happen to my ears, so. Ooh, here they are. What? Nice. Wait, am I deafening myself again? No. Don't. This way. Who's that? Come, this way. I is there somebody there? Run, honey. Oh? Huh? Who are you? This way. But who are you? Stay with me. I said, this way. He's missing one eye. No. A sweetheart. It's not like we have a lot of choice, you know? Oh, there is somebody here. Who's that? Many interesting books in this room here. Do you like books, my dear? Who, who are you? Oh, no need to be so wary. I'm merely a salesman. Salesman? Call me Ogre. I hope to get to know you, young lady. But it's quite troublesome to think that cor corpses wander the mansion. Co corpses? Those monsters back there. The little... They're, they're like creatures from a story. Why would monsters like that suddenly... Well, it's a curse. What do you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects? Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back by the power of a curse. To take revenge on your father, of course. What? I have to save him. Hmm, why is that? Toward his own ends, he has killed countless people as part of his experiments. This is his retribution. You must have realized by now your father's true nature. And yet, you wish to save him? Mom? 
my, my. Perhaps she cannot yet understand her suffering. I have to go save father. A crow? A crow? A crow. Or a crow. A crow, I think. Tips. Talk to cro crows to crow. I think it's crow. Talk to crows to save... No, wait. How do I solve this mystery? I think it's Crow. Talk to Crow to save your current progress through the his to the story. There are game ending traps abound in this abnormal mansion, below me. Yes. To so be sure to save regularly. Yes, we're going to be saving like possessed people. Okay, have to check there. Are we ready? We're going to give it a look key. Just a sh small one. Okay. And then Uh oh. Uh oh Wait, what? A doll? If I had kept walking, I might have stepped on it. When a red fork covers the screen, it means a quick time event has begun. You must press the buttons displayed on the screen within the time limit. If you fail, it may be it may result in a game over. Let's take a look. Head to the basement. A pile of discarded dolls blocks the way. This wasn't here when I came down earlier. Huh, I can't get through here. I need to think of a way to get to Father's lab. Find a way to proceed underground. Okay, my people. Oh god. Oh my god, the doll is moving. Okay. Why was that doll moving? Is that part of the curse too? My people, I played this game before and that did not happen in the previous playthrough. I'm panicking. Okay, swallow the door. What? What's... <gasps> this didn't happen either. Okay, these pokers, yes, they happen a lot. Oh my god, goodbye. Bye 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 bye. Okay. Oof, okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, my people, we're going to be saving. Ignore my previous save games. We're going to save on uh, 9 and 10. We're going to save on 10. Um. Yes, it took me 14 hours, 15 hours and 57 minutes to complete one of the playthroughs. Do not judge me. I do thank you so very much for watching and I'll see you on the next episode. Take care, people.